Hey guys, Ashen1 here. Long time no see. It feels like forever. New Game Plus Episode 3. I have been dad soulsing. Hell of a whirlwind the last two weeks. Looking after a very precious little ember of my own. Um, so, I've got a bit of free time. A bit of free time. About an hour or so. So, here we are. Now, like I say, I've been dad soulsing, so my brain is all over the place. And we're off the rails a little bit in regards to what we're supposed to be doing. Um, I know that we're talking about eventually having the Blue Blood Sword. I know that we've been looking at a stat spread for um, the Talismans of Beasts just to be as good as it can be, like uh, Magic and Faith. Um, I've been reading somewhere that 3535 is good for Talisman of Beasts to make it better than Sansi Catalyst. I've had a shout out to a good friend of mine, Ali, from my Discord server, who's mentioning that 43 and 43 are a good stat spread. <clears throat> but I think I'm just going to cap to 40 for now. And I'm sure Ali will let me know in the comments, and you guys as well, if I'm wrong, you know, we can fix it. We can fix it in the next one. So, remember this? Let me just talk you through this again. So, where we left it last time, I was showing you this farming spot for all you offliners who don't have access to the coin glitch, who don't have access to soul-sucking friends and things like that. So, Silver Catalyst and Silver Coronet are giving us enough MP to cast both Soul Sucker and... Um, Soul Thirst. I've got the Ring of Avarice on. I've got Silver Bracelets on with the correct body type. Yeah. And then I, you know, I'm trying the Thief Ring out or the, the Grave Robber's Ring to try and reduce the threat of that Black Phantom Mind Flayer seeing me or hearing me coming. Neither seem to really work though. So all I'm doing is Soul Thirst, switch to Soul Sucker up on the D-pad, run through, Soul Suck. Nine times out of ten, you're going to get the drop on him. Perfect. It. <laughs> um, very slow. You can also push up on the D-pads when you're loading like this. When you're loading near, you can push up on the D-pad, and as you can see, soul first. So, I also angled my head so my character is looking at the doorway, because this room takes ages to light up. That way you can run through nice and quick, okay? Boom. So, I'm going to keep doing this until I get 2 million souls, but I'm not going to do it on your time. What I'm going to do is... I'm going to cut to it right now. Awesome. Okay, so uh, that also gave me a chance to adjust my webcam a little bit. I think my webcam was a bit weird. Um, okay, so it, that's taken me about 27 minutes. I did. I died once, about 27 minutes. It's not bad. It's not bad. There was no way I was going to waste down your time. So I think, I think it's not a bad start, is it? Like, we're five minutes or so in, and we're looking at... Um, we're looking at two million souls here. So what I'm going to do is let let's get the talisman. I'm going to get the talisman's beast leveled nicely. Magic and faith forty. I think soft capping those is absolutely fine, right? <clears throat> and now we have to think about it. like the blue blood sword with light weapon. Now, if I put strength and dexterity to eighteen, the blue blood sword with light weapon will outclass our um, present falchion. The only problem is it, it's still really tough. It's going to be really tough um, meleeing our way through the rest of New Game Plus. So I am going to do it. But what I'm going to do is, right, what I'm going to do here is the Blue Blood Sword will come in handy. Like, we, we might, like, Garl Vinland, we probably want to, you know, give him a bit of a parry and things like that. So... 18, 18, 18, and 18 across strength, dex, magic, and faith is what you need for the blue blood sword. So I think vitality is something. Vitality being at 20 and endurance being at 30 would be really nice. I'd be feeling a lot more comfortable. I'm not feeling co confident at the moment. And one thing I will say to you, the blue blood sword is going to help us in a few pinches, but from now on, we are a ranged magic class. <laughs> Um, so what I'm going to do is Soul Sucker and Soul Thirst coming off. Firestorm 100% going in. Soul Ray's going in. Light Weapon's going in, okay? I'm then going to make sure we've got second chance. And I'm also going to put the body type back. Just so I can get that Ancient King set on and we've got that sort of defense and weight ratio thing going on. I do like, I do like the physique of my Ashen one. Type A. So, 
patches is here. Our, our item boost is quite bad, though. Even things like crescent moon grass, right? Go away. Half moon grass, go away. Even dark moon grass. Dark moon grass is awesome. I'm going to get rid of it. Um, bleeding is going to go. Just every little helps, I think. Uh, edge sharpening stone. Hey, putting that in storage is going to come back to haunt me. You watch. <laughs> Okay, um, Eddie boy, fresh spices, please. 36, that's a lovely number, my friends. Oh, that that's that was spending our souls. Okay, so, you know, I leveled up quite quickly there. Level 122. Not bad. Okay. Okay, okay. Um, Blue Blood Sword is now ready. I reckon we can get that in. I am actually going to be brave, and I'm going to get rid of the Crescent Falch. Am I going to be brave? Dark Silver Shield's coming in. We're going to need it. All this kind of stuff, like the officials close and everything's going to go. Silver bracelets. I know why we don't wear gloves, so I can still roll fast. Let's figure this out, then. Let's put Talisman of Beasts in. Chris Blade in. We're going to put Judicate Shield in for now. Mm. No, I'm going to take Dark Silver Shield for now. Bear with me, guys. Blue Blood Sword's going in. Okay, now... The Dark Silver Shield it is awesome. 100% magic defense, yeah? But, it's, but it actually lowers your magic damage. So we need to be careful having that equipped. We need second chance. Need second chance. By the way, we're kind of coming. We're close. We're at the, the edge of the um, PvP meta level now. So I wouldn't. I never said that this build would be like um, good for PvP, but maybe you can do something with it. Um, does anybody remember what the spell's called? I'm pretty sure it's second chance, right? It's because I'm in Learn Miracle. I need to be in this one. Yeah. Um, Evacuate definitely be a good spell to get. Definitely be a good spell. Okay, um I'm feeling relatively relatively confident. And I'm gonna do something crazy. I'm just gonna run to world five and get world five done. I'm gonna get the ring of magical sharpness on. I'm, I I'm gonna go glass cannon ranged magic, okay? Health regenning. Let's try it. Let's see what happens. Uh, the silver coronet could be pretty good because it is giving us that extra bit of magic, but I think we'll test it. We'll test it. Let's see if these depraved can go down without the monk's head wrappings in one soul ray. I mean, like flame toss or fireball or something would actually be really good. So I think all the enemies in this place are weak against fire. So we could bring that doesn't work. Consider doing that. And I, I, I will as well if, I, if I'm having a bit of a hard time with this. Right, so that dude... Oh, just didn't die. Okay, let's test that on this one over here. No posture, just stood still. Oh, it's so close. Oh. Got the Ring of Magical Sharpness on and I've got my Chris Bay plus five. Okay, that is heartbreaking. Absolutely heartbreaking. Um... Monk's head wrappings on. It's not the end of the world. It's not the end of the world, guys. I think we've got enough... We've got enough um, spices to get us through this. And what I would advise for you now... Consider the build. We're in a bit of a limbo until we can really, really wreck with the Blue Blood Sword. Because we want that level 99 luck stat, right? So what I would advise is... Patience. Patience ranged magic. And like I say, if I bring a fire spell here, I'm, I'm confident maybe those depraved would die in one hit without having to put the monk's head wrappings on. So just this spell embraces souls now. It's we're keeping our distance. <laughs> we're keeping our distance. <laughs> Ooh. Did he just pop second chance? I don't even I didn't even cast second chance, did I? I don't think so. No. I, don't know, I can't remember. I'm nervous. Let's get second chance on, guys. 
I think I, I was too keen testing um testing Soul Ray's damage. It might be nice to actually spend some of these boss souls that I'm hoarding. So I think something like Fireball would be really cool. It's got, it's got a slightly slower sort of fatty ca cast time to it, but it's pretty, you know. Oh, this, do you know what I love about this, guys? This is like when, when you first play the game. You're staying away from everything. Look at that. This is what it's about. Because you saw how hard those depraved hit me, right? They hit me hard. Like, that actually scared me a little bit. Right, I know I can get a lock on from up here before I commit to falling down. Here he is, look. You know you can get him as well. Come on, mate. You know you want to come up here. Oh, I'm wasting MP. Do you know what? Wasting MP, much better than wasting health at this point. And I could be more economical about this if I was... Oh, the rope. You're kidding. What a fail. The rope of the bridge. What a fail. You know, if, if I was lining these dudes up and just getting one soul ray through them all... Oh, no, I hit the poison tick. would be problematic. Ah, we're all right. Ooh, okay. We've got the Wraths of Doom. Giant Prave's going to be really hard. But Soul Ray should, when it's in its tight little walkway, all the other little depraved are with it, Soul Ray should just be, like, flying through all of them. We, we railgun them, basically. Uh, Widow's Lotus. And I'm thinking... I'm thinking... Firestorm, baby. Do this. Famous last words. Always get the right stick clicking when you do this because the chances of you hitting them all aren't always it's that, that's actually a lot better than i usually do there okay so i want full if you look at the way i'm chugging spices now spice spices are definitely a part of our lives and what's amazing about that soul farming spot with the mind flayer is that mind flayer when pure black world tendency new game plus providential ring dropping you a lot of aged spice not fresh spice aged spice Oh, this is beautiful. Yes. The name of the game, my friends, is to keep your distance. This is distance souls, okay? This is ranged. You just you just don't want to get into a stamina issue with these guys. You run in with your blue blood sword, with your light weapon buff and all that. It's going to cause a lot of trouble if your stamina runs out. These guys are hitting. Hitting. Okay, I wonder if I can... I wonder if... I can put the Adjudicator Shield on and not have to have the Crisp Blade for one-hit kills. I'm wondering if the Monk's Head Wrappings does enough. Uh, you okay, you have to hit the enemies first. No, it doesn't. Okay, that's good to know. This is a full house of Ring of Magical Sharpness, Monk's Head Wraps, a good Talisman of Beasts, I think, because it's 40 and 40 Magic and Faith. And a crisp blade plus, plus five. So it's nice to think of all the work we've done so far in the, in the original series, which was just standard new game, and coming into new game plus. We really have um, picked up as much as we can, really. What I want to do here is, is, is I, I wait. I wait until the big guy's coming. It, it didn't work there. Oh, yeah, this guy means business. That attack didn't kill me, though. That one did. Oh, shoot. That was close. I thought I was dead there. Again, spices, second chance, ranged. What I should have done on the bridge, and it's my advice to you guys, th 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 those, those depraved with their little fire pokers, if you stay, if you sort of stay within a medium range to them, they kind of waddle towards you. What'll happen is if you can come further enough down the um, bridge, the, the giant depraved will start running towards you, but he can never get past those two little ones. So you can use that to your advantage and get a couple of shots in with Sol Ray and clear all three of them. 
I kind of did it wrong there, and you saw how close I was to dying. <laughs> it wasn't fun. Right, I'm not going to waste any spice. I'm going to run straight in. Straight in, guys. Straight in, straight down. And pop one off. I was a bit, had a bit of a weird footing then, but it didn't seem to matter. Again, you know the score, guys. The whole of World 5 is all about 5-1 and Garl Vinland. They, they are the bosses, you know? There are no other bosses to this, and I don't even consider 5-2 five, five to be a boss. Really easy. Now, we have something beautiful, my friends. Something beautiful. That is Sodden Ring, which is going to cause trouble with the... I want the Sodden Rings. I don't want to waste your guys' time, okay? But at the same time, the poison is definitely going to register now. So we're not using the Adjudicator's Shield, and we're not using Regenerator's Ring. But what we do have is hopefully, with Pure White Wolf Tendency, a one-hit Soul Ray. Should, again, I should just go back and get Fireball or something. Um... I just want to make sure. Just make sure, you know, if, if we can just get through this, we can think about the. Um, we can we can think about the boss souls later on. Sorry, I just got a um, a message about this big storm that's hitting the UK. And it's like really scary. Whoa, bloody hell! That's serious. Okay, so the beautiful thing here is the fact that we're running through. With Sodden Ring, sprinty sprint. The reason I paused there, guys, and, and just went completely blank mid-thought was because I was chatting to somebody earlier. And I just realised the storm that's hit in the UK is called Storm Eunice. He was talking about his baby, and I, I think I thought he was calling his baby Eunice. That was the name of his baby. That, uh, I'm going to have to jump straight back on WhatsApp and clear that up, I think. <laughs> Ooh, pure white will tendency. We have Celine Vinland already. Hey, she is. Oh, we could kill her off right now, guys. Get that will tendency lowered. But we don't want to do that because killing the bosses would offset it. Um, and that would be a huge problem. I don't know why I'm running this way. We really don't need to come out onto dry land. We're sprinting all the way through this swamp. Again, I haven't got the... Um, I'm being a bit silly here. I haven't got the um, beef ring on. So we'll see if that comes to bite me in the butt now because we're going to come straight out of this gap here. And like I've said on other Let's Plays and live streams, don't worry about the Dark Soul drop off in water, you know, in Dark Souls games. Fighting that Hydra and you're trying to get just a little bit closer to hit the head and you just fall straight off the edge. <laughs> We don't have to worry about that in 5-2 in Demon Souls. Okay, so flying through this. Um, the important thing to do, I would say, is as you're getting close to coming out of the swamp, the depraved are going to be on you quite quickly. So what I like to do is I'd heal up to be safe. I haven't got second chance popped. Oh, no. Fool. Fool of a took. Okay, I'm going to risk this. Oh, look at that. Okay, we've got one coming behind us, look. See him there? That guy's ready for action. Okay, I'm feeling a bit better. Poison's going. Back to Sol Ray. Oh, so much to remember. Hopefully we can get through uninterrupted now. Let's come down there to get him, then come back over here to get him. I don't think the Shaman's going to die in one hit, especially if I'm not hitting him. <laughs> oh, mid-air, that was awesome. Right, Shaman probably won't die. Oh yeah. I'd say about 3% HP there left. But we're okay. We're okay. We've smashed World 5. That's awesome. If we die a few times to Garl Vinland now, who cares? Really doesn't matter. Okay, so, um, didn't really need to heal there. That was a bit of a mistake. I'm going to come in. I'm going to get enough for two Firestorms. I don't think we have to worry about wasting um, spices. We're always going to be able to buy them. Souls are no longer a problem, okay? Currency is no longer a problem. And again, I'm just going to go straight in. I'm going to I'm gonna try and get as close as I can to the Dirty Colossus and just pop Firestorm. 
Oh, what I didn't... I suppose... I don't know if I mentioned at the beginning of the um, Let's Play, what we're, the video, what we're going to do. I think because now we want to get luck up, 99. I was thinking of maybe just getting to the point where we clear the worlds. I should have mentioned this at the beginning. I, th I think I might have done. I can't remember. But what I'm thinking of doing is just getting the worlds cleared and then doing what we did in the first series before we came into New Game Plus. Lower the world tendencies with the NPCs and then use our Stones of Ephemeral Eyes for the rest of the world tendency lowering and then just um, get our Colors Demon Souls and get a plus five Dark Silver Shield. Then I'm thinking... You know, we could finish this series of this new game plus with me just farming. I could just keep farming that spot until I get luck at 99. Then what would be really cool is we'd be going into new game plus two. We'd be super, super powered up. But I'm just wondering if it's more efficient just to go into new game plus two. We'll get more souls for being in new game plus two. It'll be an easier uh, grind with that mind flayer, you know? Uh, right, I'm talking too much and... We've got Gal Vinland, and Gal Vinland is not to be messed around with. This guy it means business. So, Dark Silver Shield going on. Chris Blade is there. Right, what we're going to have to do... Okay. That's what a beast. We're actually going to have to swap this around. I'm not going to... Uh, yeah, because... Okay, just bear with me on this, guys. Got to remember what I'm doing here. First thing we want to do... Like collect ourselves, okay? Let's run in. Get rid of all of the dialogue that pops up, okay? Nineteen minutes in. Get close enough to him so he you can exhaust his dialogue. Okay, so because I'm gonna buff with light weapon, Talisman of Beasts is in my left hand, okay? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do this. Famous last words, guys. Famous last words. Boom, I can still parry him. Atmos Beast ready. Whoa, he's not dead. He tried to parry me. See that? Oh, okay, he put up a fight. I'm happy about that. He put up a fight. Touche, old boy. He still got it. He still got it. I'm not going to bother picking up his gear because we've already got it all. Touche, old boy. That was that was a good fight. I think I was unlucky with the streams of Firestorms. I think those... If I had definitely had the guts to flick left and right to Talisman of Beasts and um, Chris Blade, he would have died. But he would have died, I think, if the streams had been a bit better. But I'll take that. That back got my heart racing. That was really cool. So there's World 5 done. Um, World 1 is there as well. World 2 just... So World 3 is done. World 4 just has Old Hero and Storm King. World 1 has Alant. And World 2 just has Dragon God. You know I put Dragon God off for as long as I can. Because the Dragon God is, like, my least favourite. 195, that is enough to level up. So we may as well. I think that's enough to level up twice, maybe? My voice got really high then. I don't know why. You don't pick up any soul items in World 5. Uh, ooh. King of Lands. That's going to be an interesting fight. Oh, I don't know how good the Blue Blood Sword and the Crescent Falchion is going to be. Firestorm's really hit and miss against him as well. Whoa, we're gonna have we're gonna have a challenge with him, definitely. Um, I'm not gonna put luck up yet, guys. Okay. The reason being is because I'm going to focus leveling luck with the soul farm. That's what I'm gonna save it for. I'm not gonna put points in endurance, even though I love that more than vitality, because we're doing a lot more ranged now. I do need a bit more health. <laughs> 18 vitality and we're basically finishing New Game Plus. Ridiculous. Don't try this at home, kids. Do not try this at home. Okay, so... I wouldn't mind maybe looking at... I'm actually scared of whatever I do now. I'm really scared. Um, 
I'm I'm gonna go with King's Tower. I'm really scared. <laughs> I'm just thinking. I'm looking for a line through where I don't have to rely on the Blue Blood Sword or the Crescent Falchion. And it's tough. It's gonna be tough to find that. So for this, I'm gonna swap these back around and I'm gonna rely on ranged attacks again, okay? 21 spices should give us enough beans. Again, I could pop the fragrant ring on, you know? Don't want to regenerate my health. I could go with the fragrant ring, but it's a bit too scared at the moment. You guys, you, you guys have the best eyes ever. Oh. Rule number one. Oh my, what am I doing? I apologize, guys. <laughs> I'm so nervous. Should've got an angle on them not to waste MP. Okay, so far so good. Um, well, it's not so far so good. I've wasted way too much MP. That was ridiculous. Again, not not considering my loadout, not setting things up. Oh, the penetrator loves to roll, doesn't he? This guy's impossible to hit with magic, so it might have to be that we try and rely on. Yeah, okay. <laughs> oh, but Ulan, oh my God, she is getting in position. Oh, she wants me dead. She wants me so dead. Um, oh, this is going to be tough. This is going to be really tough. I think Longbow Ulan, she's really fast with the bow. And I think she's a bit of a roly roller as well. Yeah. There might be something in it when she fires an arrow. Oh my god, I'm dead. I'm so dead. Just casting it. Oh my god, this is the worst thing I've ever done. <gasps> How am I alive? I can only apologize for my dad's soul's brain, guys. This is ridiculous. I've never had this much trouble on, on little old New Game Plus. She did it again. Right, she technically killed me twice. <laughs> Hell of a girl. Hell of a girl. Maximum respect. Dude, where have you been? Like, we've all been fighting and, you know, what have you been doing? Come on, Tower Knight. I'm trying to get as far away from him as I can. So with this guy, again, if you're willing to waste spice, his shield doesn't do anything for magic, really. He's getting a bit of defense, but... Why not, I say? I'm not convinced I have enough spice to get through this. So what I'm wondering, I'm going to cut my losses here. They're not losses. We've just, we've killed the Black Phantoms, okay? They're gone. They are gone. So what I'm thinking is, let's head back. Let's just buy a shed load of spice, okay? Absolute shed load of spice. Um, what do I need to level up? Hold on a minute, hold on. 29,000. Bear with me, guys. I'm thinking we could get some soul items. Oh, boo. Boo, hiss, boo. I'm just wondering, can I go back, get a level up, and buy loads of spice? Probably not. Get the Stone of Ephemerize anyway. Two red-eyed knights, two snipers... Two fat officials. Ooh, Bior was freed. I remember Bior was freed um, from way back when. That's going to make it easier. I don't know why I'm picking all this up. Oh. That not going into the box is worrying. <laughs> okay. Um... I'm going to just bait the red-eyed knight to come out. I haven't got a lot of MP, but I've probably got enough. Oh, their shields are pretty good. And I'm not hitting them. <laughs> oh, got him. That's all I needed. Thank you, environments. Thank you. Okay, so need spices. And I'm going to take... I think I'm going to aggro Greatsword Dude. And the ninja will come with 
the great sword dude. Okay. Hello. Right, bring him down. All the way down. Um, yeah, he's chopped down. Yep, cool. And then this guy should be easier than the shield guy. Oh, yes, the assassin was there as well. Easy. Belt and braces, guys. Belt and braces. So, like I say, this is a patient. Um, this is a very patient ranged magic build. Right, we do now have to get across the fire bridge, but I think I can risk it. Famous last words. If I get the shortcut open, do you know what? I'm half tempted just to try a land. A land. Like I could, I could end up having a really big um, endurance battle against him, maybe. Like Firestorm will do some damage. Like it will, it will get him. Why did I stop running halfway across the bridge? That's exactly what I wanted him to do. Even if we get hit now, second chance should stop us dying. That's such a. That's definitely intended. That that's definitely part of the game design. Crystal Lizard blocking the doorway. It's definitely part of the game design. They don't do things by half. Oh no! Don't tell me he's aggroed. Nope, okay, cool. Sometimes be all. I'm sure... Oh, no, actually. I think he's only aggroed in... Have I, have I have to fight this guy up here? I'm sure he's aggroed me a few times. Or I've aggroed him. So we could kill the blue dragon. We could just stay underneath it, snipe away. But I think we'll come back and do all... <gasps> Why did I do that? The blue dragon does stay on be all. Yeah, okay, cool. It's one of those extra souls. Guys, I think I'm going to risk it. I think I'm going to try and defeat King of Land because we're here. I'm just thinking it's such a huge victory if we do it. Such a huge victory. I just don't think I've got a very good setup. I haven't got the melee damage. We'll have to see. Oh, nine times out of ten, Ostrava will just fall off the edge. Needed him to do that the first time, but actually fall off. No. Oh. Hold on. I'm sure in this playthrough I was supposed to be doing Ostrava's quest line. We missed him when we ran through World 1 3. Oh, it's all coming back to me now. I apologize, guys. I apologize. Dad's souls. My dad brain. The perfect excuse. <laughs> Okay, so King of Land's going to be tough. I'm wondering if... Hmm. I'll wait for an AoE, and I'll probably I'll probably fall back on the Crescent Falchion, but I am in big trouble here, because I'm going into this fight. I've got Age Spice here somewhere, haven't I? Yeah. Okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Five Age Spice. If we can get the... Um... If we can get the... Uh... We can get a couple of firestorms off. It might be enough, but I'm boosting all of my magic damage, but lowering all my magic defense. And he's very magic-y. Like if you think about Soul Suck and stuff, a lot of his attacks. Soul Ray's not going to do us much here, just because I think he's he's got really high magic resistance. I think firestorm, firestorm, like a good firestorm, might do about a third of his health. I th I think we can we can work with that. It's just getting it popped off. That's the... Oh my god. Second chance is gone, guys. In case you were wondering. Perfect. Okay. We can regroup. Yes! Oh my god, that was awesome! Way better than I thought. Amazing. Amazing pop blazing. How did you defeat my okay, the re there is a reason why I did that. It's because we have his soul now. And if we want to craft Northern Regalia or something, we can do that. And, you know, if we want to level up using his soul, we can. I think I've got two of his souls, though. Probably. Maybe. <laughs> okay, cool. He's given us a lot there for killing him. So why don't we... 
round like vitality at 20 i'm really happy with that now that's a bit more realistic than new game plus isn't it okay so i don't care about i don't care enough about world 2 in any way so i'm gonna go get dragon god done if you don't mind guys i'm just gonna send a quick message just need to check in Okay, so I have responsibility now, guys, so I've got to make sure if anything's happening with Ashen, Ashen Bun, I need to be there to make sure I can go, but this Ashen one has been really cool, as she always is. Okay, so what we want to do, right, I'm not messing around with this, I'm putting the Judicator Shield in, Plasma of Beasts going in, casting my second chance, switching that out. We can die a few times, guys. We can die a few times, I think. I just hate this place. I say it every time I come in, right? This guy's thug. He's gonna run away. He's really scared. Oh my god, look at my foot. That's really weird. I don't know if you can see that. My foot is like hovering in the air. Second chance. Oh, he hit me twice. Touche, old boy. Touche. I didn't know when he pulled away. That was really stupid. Sorry, guys. I was I was rushing. I was rushing there. Um, do you know what? I'm I'm gonna try I'm gonna consider not using I'm going to consider not using Stones of Ephemeral Eyes for this Is that the first time I've died in the playthrough? I think it is Do you remember me saying I hate this boss? <laughs> he makes me look stupid <laughs> What's killed me now? Mind Flayer and Dragon God? I wouldn't dare edit it out guys I wouldn't dare, I wouldn't dare try to fool you geniuses like that People, I know people who watch me stream and stuff and have showed me this boss by a million times screaming it. Like, no, that's not what you're supposed to do. But I just, I like to try and rush through the fight because the fight is so monotonous, I suppose the word is. Souls, please. See, I don't know how he saw me. How did he see me? Does anyone know? I don't know. We've got a second chance, right? Okay. We're okay. So best thing to do here, I'm wasting fresh spices, but I guess the best thing to do is just to um, keep it all popped. Ooh. Slightly terrible timing, but it paid off. It didn't pay off. I was lucky. But let's be honest. Okay, so probably I'm just I'm probably just gonna do this really rogue. I'm gonna keep running and keep bashing. Is he breathing? Yeah. What a showcase for second chance, right? Bad ashen one. Bad ashen one. Oh, why did I run then? That's not when you're supposed to run. I'm okay with it. He kills me up here. I just keep running up. Here we go. Oh, it's out of stamina then. Okay, so. Apologies, guys. Terrible show. I think if I just embrace this boss... Um, I think I would die a lot less. I probably dislike the boss a lot less as well. But, uh, no. <laughs> I refuse. Okay. 
Oh, look at that damage. Dude, sit down. Okay, so, you know me, I'm very greedy, guys. I'm always picking up the soul items. Always picking them up. Health, you know, health bar doesn't look too ridiculously low now. <laughs> um, it's still it's still not great, but it, it's, it's, it's okay, I suppose. Um, I'm going to start leveling luck. It's going to do nothing for me at the moment, but every little point's going to help. I'm going to go for it. Right, um, spices. 29,000 souls there. Hachi boy, talk to me about some spices, my friend. 36 again. That seems to be the magic number. I love it. Okay, so one, two, three, five, four is left. I would like to take some soul remains into world four, guys. I would like to do that. Do I have any in the old box of destiny? Oh, I tell you what I do have. Oh, hello. Hello, hello, hello. I have one soul remains, and I haven't freed, freed Grade Rob Oblige, but I think there are soul remains items next to where he's supposed to be. I'm a, do you know what? I'm, a, I'm absolutely okay with that. Um, i about this at all. Famous last words. Famous last words. Fossils don't weigh anything, do they? No. Okay. Um, okay, whatever. Um, that's fine. I'm spiced up. Yep. Go with late moon grass. Okay, world 4-2 is tough. Again, patience. The dark silver shield's really going to help here. But I mean, I've got to open that. I've got to open the door. I've got to open that door. I've got to open that door. And that Reaper is tough. So, no messing around. Beautiful. Those are the most important items. Um, second chance in it. Second bloody chance in it. Right. Again, I think most of the enemies in here are weaker against fire than they are magic. So... You know, I should be looking at getting those spells, you know. We've got all the resources to get them. Still no joke, that, that Reaper. Still just the worst, you know. Okay, this is really tough now, right? This is where I die. we got to get the drop on this skeleton as it's coming up. Yes! Okay, that's perfect. That's actually the literal, what, what pretty much the hardest part of all of this is that there. It's that rolling skeleton. Oh, I didn't didn't equip my. Oh, that's my bloody second shot. Oh wow. Okay, that didn't that didn't do that much damage. Oh, I'll take it. Nice. I I still to this day forget to get organized and prepare soul remains. Right. So, dark silver shield. It's going to be really handy in here. Okay. We're also going to quickly just put the blue blood sword on. Just because we want... I'll show you why, right? Let me show you why. Show you why. Those skeletons are going to be coming after us, okay? If I haven't run far enough. So, Dark Silver Shield. Boom. Gets the damage off. We still need to get past this dude. Right? You've got to watch those skeletons coming down. Okay, we're good. We're all good. Tough, very tough. All this. Also, as well, don't sprint down there wasting your stamina and then put your shield up. That can have terrible consequences. Always consider stamina management. See, it finally happens. Sometimes that Reaper does not die quick enough. Turn back on yourself. Get that Dark Silver Shield up. Right from here on out, I believe I'm. Be wrong. I could be wrong. I'm looking at. It should just be a matter of soul remains. And then we're at the boss. And then the plan for the boss is to firestorm nuke. Nukey McNuke face. Problem is getting past this guy. There we go. Oh, he made that really easy. So again, stamina. Hold shield up. 
soul remains down. Wait for the swipe or the magic. There it is. And go. Got about eight seconds. Eight seconds with the soul remains. If he does snipe you in the back, got a second chance. Right. Perfect. That was perfect. Okay, so that's 4 2 done. This build totally carries New Game Plus. But fine. We're absolutely fine. It can lift it up on its shoulders and we can get through. You know, me being stupid and impatient with Dragon God is the only death so far. Do I have enough to cast Firestorm? If so, I'm not going to use another spice. I'm not going to waste a spice with this guy. So I've got 39. Why risk it? Why risk it? Here we go. Everything in order? Yep. Uh, I'll pop the Thief Ring on. Just because why take the risks? I still do think there's a, an element of being overpowered in this run. I, what I'm loving about this now, we've got a nice mix of the Belt and Braces stuff as well. Put your Thief Ring on. You know, use your Soul Remains. It's, it feels good. It feels very well balanced. <laughs> yeah, really well balanced. Yeah, that's right, mate. That's right. Oh, this picture. That's awesome. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. That is in the air. Well, that's more like them going head to head. I like that. Oh, hold on. Obviously, I need to change the character's expression. I'm going to do a smile because it bears teeth. And I'm going to do that because that's awesome. How is that for a thumbnail? Oh. Okay, so... With the Storm King, things can go really south, right? So... I want to keep second chance on. I don't think there's any point in... Yeah, we're already at pure white, so I'm going to keep second chances there, yeah? So what I'm thinking we do... This is tough. I, I'll admit, this is tough, okay? What can happen is we can treat this like we did the soul farming spot on one of the old episodes. Even though the boss is here. But what you've got to be careful of is the boss will come quickly as we start nuking these guys. And you've got to be in a good position. And I've died plenty of times because I've been too efficient killing the manta rays. You know, and that's not a boast. It's not a boast. It's just the double-edged sword. It's the bittersweet nature that is these games. Like, the big the big guy wants to get ready now. He's just starting to get really annoyed. These guys are going down quick, yeah? No Storm Ruler needed, of course. Oh, I missed. That's annoying. Yeah, see, I, I think the big guy's coming. I think he's coming now. Yeah, he's coming. He's definitely coming. Okay, so I'm not going to mess around. Staying right here. I know there's a perfect opportunity there to get some, some loads of attacks in, but he can wreck too easy. Oh, here we go. Okay, I was speaking too soon. Ooh. You guys see that? Oh, you little... Ooh, we're out of MP. Oh, you're lucky, my boy. That's it. You go over there. Okay, if I had been a bit better with this and a bit smarter, we could have wrecked this guy. Oh, we, we can wreck him. We just use the house. This is what the house is for. Why am I trying to make this any more difficult than it needs to be? No, I can get him in the eye there. Wrecked. 
wrecked. Uh, 47 minutes in. I keep thinking this has lasted longer than it has again, but because it, you know, I did, I did some farming for 20 minutes. Um, you know, you know how it is. 47 minutes in. I need to see how long that original clip would be, actually. I'll check that. So we're ready to go to the boss now. But I'm thinking before we do that, we have the world tendency manipulation to do. So I'm fairly confident that we can handle these worlds of pure black world tendency. We'll be okay getting them, um, getting them back to pure white. Well, white. Um, we'll be okay taking on the black phantoms. I think they shouldn't give us too much trouble. I think we, we, we've got a really good loadout. So I think getting all of these colorless demon souls now and getting the dark silver shield up is the name of the game. Um, I don't know why I'm coming into these screens. Apologies. So I think a plus five dark silver shield to go into new game plus two is our goal. The question will be, do we maybe want to do like an hour farming in world three to maybe like get faith to like level 40 or something just to start getting the blue blood sword on its way that's all i'm thinking but at the moment i think we're totally fine with a lot of these worlds i don't think there's anything really that's that's worrying me um shame about the death on dragon god but that's dragon god for you and, and my impatience but i think we're, we're still we're still a bit glass cannon but we have the ability now not to necessarily need to put ourselves in danger. <laughs> and Firestorm is still there. Firestorm and Second Chance are still going. Still going strong. So I think, guys, what we might do... We'll leave it there. I've got to get back to my uh, my duties. Um, we'll get this out. And I also have a an Elden Ring video, hopefully, maybe, in the making. I think I have an idea for a video, which I might be able to get out for next Friday. So there you go, guys. I've got to get. I've got to go. I've got to get back to what I'm doing. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.